All right, guys, welcome back. I have to say, I, I mentally had to prepare myself for this one. We knew it was coming, and it is officially finally here. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Poppy Playtime Chapter 2. I can't believe I'm actually saying this, but I am pretty darn excited for this game, for this chapter, for this new update. Considering that I'm usually not excited for horror games, but I know a lot of you enjoyed it, and I must say this is in fact a very, very fun, yet creepy horror game. So, I'll confess, I'm pretty pumped. So pumped that I've got, got my water ready, got my Pellegrino ready, and I'm trying out a new flavor of G Fuel, which by the way, up until the weekend, you guys can use code hollow and save 30% off of G Fuel. The link will be down in the description. I also wanted to give a big thank you to the team over at Mob Games for sending me a code to the game to get started early on the recording aspect of it to bring it to you guys here on, on the channel. I've made it a point to look very little into this chapter. I kind of wanted everything to be a little bit of a surprise when I played it. The only thing that I do know is that we are going to just be heading deeper into the toy factory. What we are going to uncover and what toys or entities, I guess we could call them at this point, we are going to encounter. I've got I've got no idea. But I'm pumped. Thank you for being here, you guys. Enjoy these horror games. Make sure you guys drop a like. Sit back, relax. And let's do this. Alright, so here we are. The screen just changed up on us, and I'm assuming this is a description of chapter two, and it says chapter two fly in a web with poppy now free the situation begins to change rapidly while you search for any way to escape the factory <laughs> With Playtime Co.'s new patented elastic plastic, you can stretch, pull, and twist Mommy Longlegs in the craziest <laughs> ways. She loves watching you play. When you're having fun, she's having fun. The new Mommy Longlegs from Playtime Co. What's the time? Mommy Longlegs. Oh god, that is freaking Wake up. Oh, that's spooky, dude. Oh, dude, that's spooky. God darn you, mommy long legs. Well, we're finally here after the last several months waiting. We're finally in the game for chapter 2. Um I'm not sure are we in the factory? Okay, um, perhaps this is a dream, but wait a minute, aren't we a toy? So how would this be a dream? Well, I don't know. This game's all sorts of weird. Anything back here? Nope. All right, so right, left. I got to remember how to play this crap. It's been a while. Anything hiding? Hello? Mommy long legs. Are you back there? No. Can I open up the door? Yes. Per oh, okay. So we are in the factory. We were just, uh, the game was just throwing a little curveball at us, you know, just doing what it does best. And there's, there's, uh, yeah, that asshole gave me fucking nightmares. Okay. The stairs are locked. Base C9 is also locked. That is absolutely fab. Oh God. Hi. Don't talk to me like that girl. What's wrong with you? Oh. Is that a toy with blood? What in the world? Okay, what do we have here in the main entrance? Elliot Ludwig. Elliot? Okay, I'm assuming this is the way to go then. Keep going. Oh, God. Um. 
Okay, hold on. So we've got a puzzle here. Seems like. Oh, very nice. I don't think we were able to do that in chapter one, were we? Oh God, can I please have a flashlight? Oh damn, my. <laughs> I still had my arm stuck over there. Uh, press here. Yeah. About. Oh, God. Wait, how do I knock these things over? Perfect. Okay, hold on. Oh, okay. I got to hold it. Okay. It's been a while. I kind of have to get back in the groove of things. So we've got this. That's a key. Inventory. That's definitely a key. Okay. Sneaky, sneaky, huh? All right, we're gonna press that. Oh, oh, God. Listen, just stay out of here. I, I want nothing to do with you. Wait, could this key... Can someone need a hug? God. Give me a big squeeze. Oh wait, I promise I won't bite. That's right. It was like a little backpack thing that I have that gives me these arms. I'm not a toy, or was I? I, I honestly, I don't remember at the moment. I don't think I am. I think it's it's just the arms that I got. Um, if I remember correctly from chapter one, we picked it up or something. Woo! All right. Now we're getting the hang of this. And just like I'm assuming, the key must be for this door. Oh, fuck. Oh, God. Fuck. Oh, okay, new inventory. What is that? Hold on, we just got something. Daisy. Okay, perhaps just a collectible. All right, we've got a vent here. There's definitely some blood back. Oh. All right, can I can I can I close the door? Yeah, let me go ahead and close the door. We've got a tape. Ooh, we've got a tape. Okay, what does it say here? Experiment 814. How do I read this? Shit, can I not read it? Notes. This experiment utilizes a... Fuck, bro. I can't even see that. Hold on. I've got to say, even with my glasses on, I, I, I cannot read this. Like, the letters are so tiny. And I don't think I can put, like, the, the letters bigger on screen. But I'll try and read it out for you guys. So, Experiment 814. It says notes the experiment utilized a live rat the rat was fed three portions daily for two weeks at the end of the two weeks the rat was killed and submerged into a poppy flower and uh preservative gel mixture one week later an electric shock was applied to the rat still in the gel in an attempt to revive it uh, the rat uh, remained un unresponsive analysis says uh i still believe that the uh potential of the pop of the poppy flower i don't know if i'm saying that word right is unusual or it says i still believe in the potential of the poppy uh, flower its unusual properties led or lead me to believe that the proper mixture and procedure could have life altering properties the poppy flower has uh for a long time carried uh heavy symbolism and i do not believe that it's for no reason perhaps something larger than a rat's would yield different results am i is that the right word i can't god i wish i could see it better maybe this will give us a visual playtime co is the product of a great man by the name of elliot ludwig divorced but a family man at heart his sights were always set on bringing amazing toys to amazing children around the globe Ludwig spent countless hours in the factory, working overtime relentlessly in an attempt to continuously innovate and surprise. In the 1960s, an unfortunate family death had pushed Ludwig down to his lowest. 
but with so much ambition, he rose back up and continued to fulfill his vision for the Playtime Co. toy factory. Ludwig could never be content leaving a project unfinished. But just how did one man come to create such an astounding empire? How did he manage to stay determined even after suffering such a tragic loss? It all began in the fateful year of 19... Huh? Oh, hi. Interesting. So I thought that was going to be the vent we were going into, but it appears like I was wrong. All right, let's go inside. Fuck it. Here we go. Oh, God, I cannot stand these freaking confined spaces. Mommy! I sound so stupid calling that out. M mommy? I don't trust this game, dude. Ah! Oh, uh, sorry. I didn't mean to scare you. I was just trying to get the power back on. Here. Shh. How fucking dare you? Wait. go was it this way yes nice okay <laughs> um i wanted to thank you for freeing me i was stuck in there for so long thank you i'd like to pay you back there's a train station nearby it needs a coke I haven't. We're gonna get out of here. As soon as you get on up here. <laughs> Come on. Okay. Well, I'm still a doll. Okay. This way? Wait, isn't this where we came from? On the right track. I should be able to follow you through the vents. This way. Yeah, I'm not really a big fan of that, you know? Alright, so the vents, those smaller vents are not for me, but for the doll. So she... Okay, now we have access to this gate. We got right. We got left. Not a problem. Okay, good. I'm gonna jump. Oh, oh, hold on, hold on. <laughs> Woo oh my god. Oh, dude, that's terrifying. Alright, we're gonna go ahead and check all the corners. All the doors seem to be locked. Got another dead toy. No big deal. All right, so you see how you're singing right now and just humming along? That's just, that's not it. You're freaking me out. Listen, I'm going to need you to trust me. <laughs> what the fuck? Yeah, no, 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 no. Do you expect me to jump down there? Oh my god. What happens if I bring this toy and throw it into the ditch? Into the hole? I I'm gonna use it as bait. Here we go. Nothing. Okay. Perfect. Uh, fuck. Should I jump? Ah! 
Okay, we jumped. Okay, good. I was supposed to jump. Oh my god. Are you kidding me? Elliot Ludwig. Hmm. Eddie MNR. Leith Pierre. Power. Okay, we've got the game station here. That does not look safe. So we are not going to interact with that door back there. We're going to go this way and see if we can turn on the power. All right, so. We've got one and two. So. No, it's got to be like this. Fuck. Hmm. Okay. What about... this way maybe through here oh hold on hold on hold on ah ha huh. Interesting. Got it. I got it. That's right. The game station is now open, ladies and gentlemen. I am a genius. All right. Keep going here. Still don't trust this factory. Fuck that. This lady is no joke, dude. She's no joke. Uh, I wonder if these are going to be um, some possible future characters. Okay, everything seems to, got, to have gotten quiet. I do not like this. I will pull the lever. Open up the door. Oh, fuck. So now we've got three different game stations that we have to pass in order to get the code to the train press here okay by the way this looks like an amazing amusement park or of sorts toy factory whatever for kids a lot of cobwebs it's been abandoned for quite some time. Got the statues. Musical memory. Here we go. Preparing for departure in three, two, one. Choo -choo! A 
Okay. Should I pull the lever? Hi, kids. Welcome to the game station. I'm Stella, and we've got three super duper fun games to play. These little tests show us just how crazy strong and smart you are. Follow Mommy Long Legs down the stairs, and we'll start by playing Musical Memory. See you in a bit. Uh. Where is it? The floor open up? Oh shit. Oh gosh. We're going deeper into the shit. Fucking mommy long legs. That's locked. Um. Oh. Wow. I'm sorry I'm not talking much. I'm just honestly, I'm trying to be leveled. Uh, keep, keep my head leveled. Be level headed. Uh, and, and, and just stay focused on the task that is at hand. And that is survival. Molding room. Okay. Pull the lever. Oh, God. All right. Fine. Everything's okay. Another tape. Yes. Oh, is this like some sort of memory game or some shit? Okay, hold on. Let me just check out the facility first. Make sure. Okay, that's locked. We're gonna have to play first. Fuck. Alright. Let's go ahead and play. Let's play the game. Oh, here we go. Be a chess player. gotta find our green hand or not yeah mommy I've, 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 I feel so stupid calling her that uh, we've got a problem I need my other hand okay um all right let's press this button See how to fix it. Hmm. Alright, let me press it again. Perhaps it just got stuck. But impress it again. Hmm. 
needs ink. Okay, how do I? No paints in the machine. Oh. Okay, okay, okay. What was that? New lights turned on. Fine. That must be a clue. I will take the stairs in the direction of up. And perhaps that's where the ink might be. Or the paint. Whatever. Oh, here's the paint. Yeah, there's the green paint. Perfect. This is actually pretty cool. They've they're they're making us um create our own hand, essentially. <laughs> the hand that she took! Now the question here is. Oh, the ink goes up. Oh my god, are you kidding me? I don't even know why I jumped down. I was so stupid. Alright, let's go back upstairs. Everything's fine. Everything is still under control. Our composure has been kept all this time. We've only had two serious jump scares, but that's fine. That is perfectly fine. Alright, so issue number two has been resolved. There goes that. Uh, please give me back my green hand. All right, now the delivery phase. Bada bing, bada boom. I've got to be careful. All right, you don't mind. said this and then we'll head this way correct yes you got it right perfect all right we're in business let's go okay so this is actually the entrance this is i'm sure we were on the other side of this gate here i think we were actually huh Okay. Nothing interesting in here. Not a problem. Think green. Reduce, reuse, and recycle. I know when your birthday is. June 28th. <laughs> you know what would have been really creepy? If they found some way to get the database in your Steam account or something and know when your birthday is and then actually say it for individual basis that would have been super freaky but maybe we shouldn't keep things that freaky maybe maybe we should just uh, settle down here all right i don't know what this is oh god okay yeah i don't like that we're gonna die here huh welcome to musical memory oh this is terrible. This advanced memory and cognitive recognition test is designed to stimulate several segments of the brain, allowing us to see how quickly and efficiently your brain works. Oh, no. A sequence of colors will be shown, and you must recreate the exact sequence using the buttons around you. Bunzo will slowly lower towards you. When you complete a color pattern correctly, Bunzo will rise back up. When you input a pattern incorrectly, Bunzo will lower towards you faster. If Bunzo reaches you, your test is over. The test will become more difficult as it continues, with longer patterns in quicker succession. That's all. Good luck. You've got to be fucking with me right now. Oh, isn't it amazing? Mommy hasn't seen the place up and running in years. Mommy can only imagine how excited Bunzo must be. It's been such a long time since he's been able to play, to cheer, to eat. Bunzo, Good luck. Stay away. Look, look at those fucking teeth, man. That's just a kid's toy. What are you doing? Red. Red. Yellow. Red. Yellow. Blue. Red. Yellow. Blue. Red. 
yellow, blue, yellow, red, Ye yellow, blue, yellow, red, yellow, blue, yellow, blue, ah, red, yellow, blue, yellow, blue. Round two. No. Oh, Green. Green. Yellow. Green. Yellow. Green. Yellow. Blue. Green. Yellow. Blue. Green. Yellow. Blue. Green. Green. Yellow. Blue. Green. Green. Yellow. Blue. Green. 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 Yellow. Blue. Green. Green. Yellow, yellow, blue, green, 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 violet. Green, yellow, blue, green, green, violet. Where's violet? Where's violet? Green, yellow, blue, green, green, violet. Round three. Violet. Violet red. Violet red white. What the fuck? Violet red white orange. Violet red white orange red. Violet red white orange. Violet red white orange red red. Violet. Red, white, orange, red, red. Did I do it? Round four. Whoa, what the fuck? Come on! Blue. Blue J. Blue J heart. What is this? Blue J heart. Blue J heart. Blue. Blue J. Hearts blue. Blue J hearts blue. Why? B blue J hearts red. Pie. Blue J hearts blue. Why? Uh, fuck. Blue J hearts. Yo, what's up with those Jake. arms? <laughs> uh, Mommy was hoping the game could last a little longer. It's okay, though. Mommy knows other ways to play with you. <laughs> this fucking bitch, dude. You are a bitch. You animal. Okay, so part of the code. Um. Uh, Train code, okay. Playtime code, train access instructions. 
Uh, okay. That was pointless. I will open up the vents. And there we go. Okay. Um. Right, can I go inside the middle here? See if there's anything. Maybe some sort of trophy or something. Maybe we should stay out of this area. Maybe we should just go inside the vents. Yeah, that, that probably sounds like a better idea. Alright, let's get out of here. I don't like the vents in this game. I've had uh, really bad uh, scenarios in Chapter 1. And quite frankly, I've got some PTSD. Fuck. Ah. Stop. Back away. Back away. Back away. Stay away. Okay, good, 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 good. Woo. All right, so we are now officially at the play care. What is the play care? Nobody here cares. Look at this. These are all damaged toys. This is like a little kid's worst nightmare. Want to hear a dino joke? Click once for the question. Click again for the punchline. <laughs> What do you call a dino with one eye? Uh, do you think he saw us? <laughs> yeah. Alright. That was a terrible joke. Now don't kill me. Oh god. Fuck. Please, whatever you do, do not fucking move. Because I will literally just shit myself I don't need a damn toy dinosaur chasing me around now that's the last thing I freaking need here all right all right we've got that there also seems to be some sort of VHS uh, player somewhere damaged do not freaking move I swear um, that's locked Where, where is there a tape here? Oh, hi. Warning, high capacity reached. Easy does it. Come on. All along now. There we go. Now, I'm not looking anywhere else but at this crane. I'm just hoping that nothing pops up from behind and snatches my ass. Okay, hold on. This area is blocked. Hmm. Dude, I don't know what we're going to get. Like, what are we going to grab that's going to be able to slam on top of that dinosaur? Let's try this out. See what happens. Ah, it's gonna break. He's gonna he's gonna drop it. He's gonna drop it. And it's gonna break. No. Okay. Perfect. Ah. Ah. Perfect. Nice. So it wasn't lifting as much before because of the weight of the dinosaur. Okay. We've got... Oh, fuck. Oh, we can't go that way. Gotta go this way. The fuck? Oh, God. Uh-uh. No, 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 no. Calm down. Calm down. Let's just calm down. Calm it down. Fuck, 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 fuck.
Wait, man. What the fuck? real right now like there we go there we freaking go there we freaking go that's what i'm talking about 200 iq uh, iq plays <laughs> sorry i'm kind of nervous i can't even speak right now and it's like fucking one in the morning, which is what makes it all the worse. All right. All right. What is that laugh gas? Ain't nobody laughing. Okay, we'll just go upstairs. Things okay. Now, according to what I've seen, this game's supposed to be longer. Why would they do that? Why would they block that door out? Hello? Let's party. Okay, this might be game number two. Oh, this doesn't look good. Wait, we're oh, we're back here. All right, most definitely. Okay, so now we probably got to put a portion of the code that we got. Or play game number two. Hold on, we've got the green arm now, so we can probably play some here. Aha! Suckers! Ah, oh, look at this. Ears, Poppy. Uh, ears, what was the name of the, uh, of the blue guy? It's not Poppy, it's uh, Huggy or something like that. Okay, so. Okay, I don't think I can interact with this right now. Which would make total sense. Got game number two right now. Let's go. Game number oh, dos. You did fantastic. Who gave you permission to be this smart? <laughs> Mommy is super proud of you. But I'm sure she's already told you that herself. Our next game is Waggo Wuggy. Head downstairs and have fun. Oh, fuck me. Wack a Wuggy. Oh, Lord. I kind of like this concept, though. You know, it's it's like mini games in a sense, and if you fail the mini games, well, you have repercussions. <laughs> so don't suck. Whack a wuggy, whack a wuggy, whack a wuggy. Oh god, yeah. Uh oh. What the fuck is it? <laughs> Alrighty then. Welcome to Wacka Wuggy. This advanced test is designed to assess the extent of your reactionary abilities. A dual palm grab pack will be provided to you for this test. Around you are 18 sizable holes. An adorable Huggy Wuggy toy could appear out of any one of these holes. Oh my god. If one comes out, hit it with your grab pack. That's all. Good luck. Fuck. I don't like the shit. The toys in oh. this game used to have strings attached to them so they could be pulled back when they got too close to the children. Hmm. Have fun. Uh oh. 
Oh god. Stop fucking playing right now. That long ass arm of yours, mommy. Give it to me, mommy. Give it to me. Fuck it, bitch. Give me the shit. Thank God there's no round two for that shit. That Only was horrible. One game left to play. Sad. Mommy was hoping you'd stay here forever. Though it's never too late to change your mind. <laughs> Dude, that was so fucking terrifying. <laughs> that was horrible, dude. Oh my god. You have like seven of them growling at you. Uh uh, that was no fun. Me don't like that one. I've also got a feeling she's gonna get really upset once we beat all the three games and she's gonna be chasing us and God knows what else. This chapter is a lot longer. Maybe I just... What didn't I think of that before? Look at this. Look how much more simple that is. Just walk on the rail. Push the button to feed me candy. Nom nom nom. Feed me more. Okay. Nom nom nom. More. More candy. Nom nom nom. nom. You want more candy? Here! No more candy. My tummy's full. Now nah, fuck that. I nom nom. I said no more. I nom nom. Stop! Keep eating candy. Yeah, that's probably not good. Press the button to feed the candy. <laughs> Okay. 
make a run for it. I better not see a, a giant cat after my ass. He's probably upset because I fed him too much candy, but... I think I really give a shit. I think I actually care. I don't. Just... Oh. Oh. Who's that? No, 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 no. He's back! No! You motherfucker! Oh, that's not him. Oh. That's his girlfriend. What are you looking at? Trust her. Did you not see the look in her eyes? Huh? What was her name? Kissy, I think it was. You're kissy, 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 kissy. Hello? Are we gonna be friendly? Are we gonna play nice? I don't think she wants to play nice. I think she wants to kill me. Barry. Oh. Okay. Oh, fuck me. Hold on. It's gonna be just fine, Barry. Oh, wow. Okay, so maybe now. Okay, Barry. Oh, no, Barry. Sean. Mind if I film this? Oh, not at all, sir. That's what I like to hear. So, Marcus, what happened? You see, I was heading home for the day when my apars realized that I left me bloody wallet in the cafeteria. So, I'm running through the lobby, and that's when I see it. A mop handle lodged under the innovation wing gate. So what you do, Marcus? Well, I just thought I'd nab the bloody yoke and be on me merry way. And? Well, I'm reaching for the thing, and the bob handle jolts on its own. Had me scared stiff. I, I thought I was the only one there. So, I, I took a peek beneath the gate, and some massive bloody thing was dothering about the bloody hallway. Thing? You're sure it wasn't a person? Ain't no person that's 50 feet long with a thousand legs. Marcus, you're losing me. 
Maybe you just saw a bunch of people walking by. Look, it wasn't people, all right? I happen to bloody know what it was, but it wasn't human. Hmm. Who have you told about this? Besides me, obviously. Just you, sir. Obviously. Okay. I'll have security skim the cameras and take a look. What? There's a massive bloody monster! Skimming ain't gonna get rid of it! You're out of line, Marcus. We make toys, not monsters. Now come on, get out of my sight. Actually, yeah, uh, Marcus. Grab me a coffee, will you? <laughs> Actually, never mind. Get out of my sight. Good for you, man. It's awesome. Good for Sean. That's awesome. Good shit. That was awesome. That was really awesome. Okay, so, uh, there is a monster on the loose. Um, can I open? Okay, we just opened that one up. Fuck, how are we gonna do this? Okay, that works. Let's go, Barry! Did he make it? He got stuck! What? Oh, that's some bullshit! You've gotta be you've gotta be kidding me right now. So what I had to do was drop the frames in the NVIDIA settings in order to get this cart to keep moving. <laughs> and that's what it did. As you can see right now, the game is horrible. But, that was the only way to get that cart unstuck. So, we're gonna change it back now, but I just wanna make sure I get a checkpoint before I do. Cause for sure it was a glitch. It was a glitch 100%. All right, so we'll get Barry down this way. Yeah, oh my God, this is so disgusting. These 30 FPS. It's driving me insane. Oh, God. Yeah, we good? I want to get a little bit further just in case. Um. Oh, fuck. <sighs> All right, so we're back. We restarted the game. And um, here we go. So... Let's do this. We've got here a grab pack storage. I think we've seen this storage room before. This game is actually quite long. Now we're back in the middle, going for our third game. That's nice. Hmm. The third game. What can the third game be? Jeez, have you played? It's probably gonna stink. You're so good. Seems like you're ready for the final game, Statues! Follow Mommy down the stairs one last time. I hope you had a fun day at the game station. See you next time. Something tells me this is gonna be the... Statue. Something tells me this is gonna be the worst one. Open it, dude. Oh my god. Crisscross. Alright, I think that's enough. Alright, mommy. Listen here, you fucking bitch. Don't try anything stupid. I'll chop you up. Hit you with the one two combo. Hmm. Okay, what the fuck? Hello? Mommy? Mommy long legs? Oh. Do you want to play with PJ? Oh, God. Tracker Miller? Or Bug? Sounds was... like Scooby Doo. <laughs> Oh, 
Oh, come on. Hold on, what is that up there? What? Are you insane? How does that make any sense? This is one. That's... Huh? Wait. Maybe, maybe, maybe we're done. Just... Just sounds like a glitch. It's not a glitch. Oh. Welcome to Statues. This advanced obstacle course is designed to test your physical endurance and strength. The rules are simple. The lights will turn off. You can move through the obstacle course at this time. However, when the lights turn on, you can look around but cannot move. Oh my god. You may move again once the lights turn back off. The lovable PJ Pugapillar <laughs> will follow you. If PJ reaches you, your test is over. That's all. Good luck. Oh. Whoa. Whoa, what are you what are you Okay. Oh god, what the fuck? It was always so sad to see the kids go. They called me mommy because I was the closest thing they ever had to one. But they come for games and never come back. They left mommy to die alone. Mommy didn't deserve that. But you, you worked here. So if anyone deserves to die alone, it's you. Absolutely terrible. You kidding me right now? Oh, God. up oh my God. Oh, this is some bullshit
Where am I supposed to go here? What is going on? again i don't know if the game glitched there or what that was but okay So nervous right now. This side up. Um. Oh my god, bro! What's going on? Just gotta stay cool, okay? Don't lose our composure. The moment we lose our cool is the moment we're fucked. Okay, we need to tape. Do we need to tape? Maybe not. What is this? Abilities. Mommy Longleg has the unique ability to stretch any of her limbs for several hundred feet. This includes her fingers, arms, and hair, neck, waist, and legs. She's very hostile towards the staff, but is very motherly and acts warmly towards the other experiments. She, uh, she is protective of them. The problem is our hostility is quickly becoming a problem is becoming pro problematic, but perhaps there's a solution to put her in her place. Mommy long legs would be perfect for facilitating everything with the children and the game station. She has the warmth that a mother should and uh, any rowdy child can learn to listen to their mother. It makes sense that her seeing these uh, children daily would improve her behavior. And it is very unlikely she will act out in front of the children. Have her transferred to high security maintenance immediately. Condition can begin. 
Conditioning can begin. All right, bitch. tape here that I can get to know exactly what the hell I gotta do no no no, no. stop stop perfect yes all right we got it all right, so I think the ultimate goal here is to go to the game station but uh Maybe not. What is this? Meow, 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 bud. Oh, God, are you fucking kidding me? Gotta keep going. Okay, um Wait, what am I supposed What is this? So the toys go here, or they come from there. No, it's got to be this way. All right. So I will hold down a little bit. Okay, they come from here. So they can go through this tube here. Oh, I just have to press one. <laughs> okay, so I got the toy. I don't know if that does anything for me at all. Perfect. So we'll go now. And we will put this there. Hello? I don't like this. terrifying Oof. oh my goodness okay it says don't put your hand there fuck you want me to do
Nice. Fuck yeah. Gosh. I wish I had a red tape. Play the red tape. Red. Am I a real boy? <laughs> I'm trying to see if there's a tape somewhere here. I'm sure there is one at somewhere. Or maybe that's just there in case we haven't played some of the previous tapes. Who knows? That. Hmm. Okay. Down into the vents we go again, boy. This is the shit that I don't like. Mm -mm. This is the shit I don't like. Got to be something we can grab onto, right? Cool it, sister. Is that the train? Cool it, sister. Cool it. Let's fucking cool it. Calm it down. Oh, God. I feel a jump scare coming up. Really fucking quickly. All right, check the surroundings. Come on, pull the lever. Which one will open? This one. Here we go, baby. I'm out of here. Oh, that's some bullshit. Oh, that's some bullshit. Oh, you fucking tease. Oh, come on. Oh, no, we've got a letter. The construction company. This is Eddie responding once again on behalf of Playtime Company Toy Factory. Yes, it must be. In complete secrecy, uh, this project uh, should only be known about by those uh, with authority at the Warren Batch. Or what is that? War Warren Batch? Yeah, Warren Batch. Um, and those with uh, authority here at Playtime. As promised, you will be compensated very well for this secrecy. Upwards of $100,000. Keeping in mind that this is a ballpark figure. Uh, we're willing to provide the proper equipment needed for excavation. However... The um, 
the more independently you are able to work the more compensation i can offer we'd still like to see the lab completed in 12 months time but what's most important is that it's done right let me know if these terms work for you i'm happy to negotiate until we find something we both that both parties can uh, be happy with eddie mn ritman all right there's nothing on the back of the letter so this was a secret lab down here Mommy knows best. Mommy don't know shit. This is probably the door to his office. Mommy don't know shit. Fuck. Staff only. She's gonna pop out. She's gonna pop out. This is bullshit. Yeah, red. Uh, okay. Oh, the combination. Red. Blue. Green. Red, blue, blue. Red, blue, green. And then. Hold on. Red. Blue. Get out of here. Want well, nothing to do with this fucking company anymore. I'm done. I'm fed up. I'm suing your ass. You're fired. I'm on fire. Fuck. Oh, God. Oh, God. Okay. Fine. Fine. This is so stressful, dude. This is so stressful. Are you serious? Here she comes again. Oh, she came from the vents. Fucking bitch. Okay, we've got this. We've got that. We gotta scope out the area before we do anything. got something red up here. Is that the choo-choo train? What is that light? That might just be a light. I don't know what that is. Maintenance list ensure the machinery is clear of debris. Wipe the machine surface of lubricant dirt uh, and other other loose debris. Check uh, and replace worn or damaged parts. Check machinery, fluid levels. Check belts. Okay. Main uh, gear removed. Damage beyond repairs. Please replace ASAP. So the main gear. Where's the main gear? Okay.
kidding me right now? Okay, hold on. Yes! Finally, okay. So now we gotta put this here. Now we can pull. It says do not enter. <laughs> How convenient. Oh god. Oh, you fucking suck! Now let's do this. Convenient. How fucking convenient. A room with her face on it. that be the next one or are we gonna see that thing here fuck please just get me out of here dude just get me the fuck out of here Probably the tape, uh, the, the monster that we're talking about in the tape. Oh god. Where the freak are we? <gasps> oh god, we're here. Alright, so we've got all the code to the train, right? Or did she ever give it to me? I don't know if she ever did. Maybe it's in the. If she didn't, then maybe it's in the tape. So you know, I don't trust her ass either. I don't trust nobody here. Fuck this. Man, I can't read these fucking notes. I'll read this one. Uh, 
Quick touring, uh, at the game station. Uh, start by reporting to the control station. Always keep a minimum distance of 20 yards away from mommy long legs. The train will arrive with the children at 8 a.m. All children will be gathered inside the game station at once. Uh, the order of the games that should be musical memory, Wacka Wuggy, and then statues. A series of bridges and doors from the control station that should guide you to each game. Mommy Long Legs can assist in escorting the children to each game. Only one child that should ever play a game at a time. Children who are not playing will have to wait in the game station. There are playground equipments uh, to keep them entertained. Uh, record each children's performance as it is relevant to each game. Musical memory, composure, memory pattern, recognition, whack a wug, hand eye, uh, coordination, and reaction time. Statues, agility, strength, and speed. Once the children have left for the day, return to the control station. Give all reports to Miss Stella and sort it throughout. Okay. Wow, they were using the children as well. It's fucked up. That was so fucked. Okay, this is opened. Want me to fucking go in through there? Are you insane? What happened to my blue arm? It's gotta be a glitch. <laughs> Are we really about to leave? Oh shit. Okay. The train code. Oh, okay. So now this is going to be uh, red, yellow, red. And then blue. And then it's... Um, at the end it is... One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Two, four, three, one. There we go. Yo. Are we really leaving? Oh my god. I don't know what happened to my other arm, but <laughs> We're gone, bitch. Ooh. I have a feeling something's going to happen. We're not gone, are we? There's no there's just no fucking way. Oh, this 
there's gonna be a creature there. Maybe that thing just ate her up. Frank! chapter three like i want to know what happens with this employee what happens with us like oh my god wow i have a feeling that we're gonna we're gonna come across that 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 thing that ate up uh mommy or whatever her name is after she was like cut up into pieces just kind of swallowed her just dragged her in there it was a prohibited area but holy smokes this game is so well done and it just came out of nowhere when chapter one released and now here we are at chapter two waiting now for chapter three which uh, i think it's gonna be darker than 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 both of these chapters just because we're going deeper and deeper and deeper i mean that train was going for a hot minute i don't know where we're gonna end up but uh i think we're gonna call it quits here i don't know if we have any sort of like uh Let's see if we have something after the uh, credits. Maybe we do. Yikes. Wow. All right, so we don't. Guys, we are going to end it right here. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed chapter two, be sure to drop it a like. It helps me out and it helps this video do well. I've been recording for about three hours, so <laughs> this was a long one. Again, thank you for the support. A huge thank you to Mob Games uh, for the code and great job, guys. Keep 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 doing what you're doing. You're doing it right. It's one hell of a game, and uh, I hope you guys had a good time. So, again, thank you, and I will catch you later. <laughs>